Hey guys, what's up? And thanks for stopping by my channel, Krista Michelle. And today I'm here to show you guys how I achieved this cute little fro that I have going on using the My DNA products. So let's go ahead and jump right into it. First thing I did was use the My DNA Sulfate Free Shampoo. And as I apply this product, it's for spiral, wavy, kinky, coily, straight hair. And pretty much is supposed to cleanse and moisturize your natural hair. And this product claims to be sulfate free and um, pretty much it just gets rid of any residue without stripping the hair. And it did exactly that. Out of all of the products, um, this one was my favorite. I really did get my hair clean. My hair felt very moisturized after using it. I did like that it lathered. And um, afterwards, my hair felt moisturized. So overall, I enjoyed this product. So once I rinsed that out, I then used the My DNA Detangling Conditioner. And this is supposed to strengthen and moisturize natural hair textures. And what I will say about this product, it definitely has a lot of slip. So if you're looking for something that's good for detangling, I would use this product. Um, I did feel, however, that it wasn't the most moisturizing conditioner. Um, when I applied it on, I had a lot, a lot of slip, and it just felt like a detangler, but I wouldn't say it felt like a conditioner. Like, I don't know if my hair felt super moisturized after using this product. But I was able to detangle in the shower. Um, it was easy to get anything out. I just used my fingers to detangle, and then afterwards, I rinsed my hair out using this. But I definitely would have wanted to follow up with, like, a deep conditioner. I think they do have deep conditioning masks just something that would just provide my hair some extra moisture so after using the detangling conditioner working that through I then allowed my hair to dry and I applied the Aqueous Essentials hair turban and what I like about this product is that you can just put it on and throw your hair up and it's just the easiest thing versus towels that are like falling all over the place and it just gets so annoying so I used that to dry my hair because I wanted to do a fluffy twist out and so I pretty much wanted my hair semi dry, semi damp, almost to dry. And then once I, you know, had my hair dry in chunky sections, uh, then apply the My DNA Moisturizing Hair Butter and it moisturizes for all natural hair textures and the first ingredients are water, shea butter, glycerin, um, middle foam and seed oil. I don't believe these products are 100% natural. This product does have mineral oil in it just in case you guys are interested in the ingredients. I'll leave the prices and all the information about the My DNA line down below. And what I did is I pretty much worked this product in root to tip. I detangled with the My DNA comb, another one of my favorite things that I received. I love detangling combs like this. I didn't feel like my hair was getting ripped out and I just really made my hair nice and fluffy and then I just sealed with an oil after applying this butter. This literally is like a moisturizing cream. Um, it's not thick, it's very light for ladies who have um, light hair. It did pretty much penetrate into my hair. I did feel like it left a little bit of like a, a film or some kind of weird texture. I don't know how to explain it, but it did leave my hair moisturized. My hair feels very soft. The first time I used this, I just used this alone. I definitely recommend sealing with an oil. So you guys will see me sealing with an oil and applying oil to take it down. If you don't seal with the oil, your hair will feel dry. And then after that, I just allowed my hair to air dry once I put it in chunky twists. And then I pretty much just used my diffuser just to make sure my hair was really, really dry because I have a boys to men concert tonight. Ooh, so excited. And so um, after having my hair air dry and then using the diffuser to dry, I just added a little bit more oil to my hands. I took my hair down and then all I did is once again went back in with the My DNA comb and I just used it as a pick, which I love to just really fluff out the roots. And as you guys know, if you're not a, you know, a new person to my channel, I do have a tapered cut so this side is a lot shorter and so I just used some bobby pins to pin this side up and just have my hair go over on the top. So it's just like a really, really cute um, fro as if I got my hair cut into this style. So what I will say about this butter is that if you have a thicker texture than me and you really want more hold and definition, um, so like picking your hair out, then you definitely will need to follow up with like maybe the My DNA Custard or any curling cream or gel you have because this product does not really give you any hold at all. When I used it before, by the end of the day, my hair had frizzed out. So definitely will leave your hair moisturized. Um, I wouldn't say my hair is as shiny as it usually is and it doesn't give a lot of definition but I will say overall with the line it did leave my hair moisturized and I'm very satisfied with it. Oh guys and before I forget this is the lippy that I have on my lips right now. 
Um, I don't remember the name of it, so I will leave it right here and also leave a link down below. But I am just feeling these matte lipsticks. It's the same one that made that Jamocha lipstick, but I am loving this beautiful red lipstick. So guys, let me know what you think about this style and what you think about the My DNA products. I am having a giveaway because I received the second set and because my hair is so short, I don't need it. So I'm going to give it to you guys. So in order to enter, you have to be 18 years or older or do have your parents' permission. And down below, only comment once guys one entry but just comment down below what is the next hair tutorial you guys would like to see on my channel and probably a really fun summary style i'm really curious to see what you guys are interested in and as always happy healthy hair journey and i hope to see you guys in the next video bye